Hey Libra, so this is LT Tarot about to do a love reading for you for the next 30 days. I hope that everything has been great and amazing for you guys. Um, if you haven't already, please make sure that you like, you comment, and subscribe to the channel. Understand that my readings are timeless. So whenever you read, I mean, whenever you watch this reading, it's, it could be applicable for you for the next 30 days if it resonates. So I'm going to use this deck here, and then I'm going to clarify with my other card. Uh, my other deck and then we're gonna go ahead and get started I'm not gonna keep you guys too long yeah, doing it backwards okay hey guys hey guys hey guys no, I'm playing with you guys so let's pull out five cards here You guys, I've been going live a lot, so if you guys like have a question, um, if you guys have a question that you want to um, get answered, you can always do it on my live, or if you want to do a personal reading, you can always book a personal reading with me, and then I'll, um, you can find me on like Instagram at lt.tarot, and you can actually book a reading there, or you can, um, you can actually uh, click on the link below and book a read. But uh, always find me on, um, if you like strap for cash or just want a free reading or just try me out, always uh, find me on the live readings. Because I just take donations on that one. Pull another card here. So the first card or the overall energy is passion and then you have the four of wands. So this is letting me know like this is a relationship that I feel like it's, um, it's actually surrounded by sex or it's built on sex or built on some type of passion. Um, it could be like, I feel like it's sexual passion with this card because if you look at it, you know, it's like they're having sex, but it's like this relationship is built on some type of sexual energy. I feel like this is a, a connection that um, you find balance in, you find a foundation in, um, because I just feel like the uh, passion is the foundation here, especially with the four of wands. Um, I feel like this is something where you either, I feel like it's going to be something that's long term though, because of the fact that this card can also represent marriage as well. Or but this kind of like building something long term, I feel like this card is representing like the passion is the foundation of this relationship here. I feel like you guys have this cute little relationship where you text each other. You have like the love letter here um, where you texting each other and um, sending little messages. I feel like some of those messages could be triggering for you, Libra. Um, maybe it's triggering some heartbreak. Maybe you feel like, okay, well, you know, my ex did this or this person could have done this in the past. It will text you or send these cute little love messages and you may feel like, okay, well, I want more than that, you know, or... And I feel like this is cute, though, because if the sex is good and then you're getting these cute little messages from this person, don't let whatever your past hurt may be, you know, don't let that uh, interfere with the situation because I feel like this is something that can build, especially with that uh, four ones card being like the foundation card. But I feel like uh, with the three of um, swords, you know, you've been hurt before and maybe this is something that this person started doing this after um after you found out something hurtful about this person um but i definitely feel like you know this is cute you know this person is definitely sending you little love messages you guys are having good sex i feel like so far this is cute a, a good cute connection you 
you do have the longing card and the chariot card i feel like you've been longing for a situation to be like maybe that's what it is you like the sex you like the the text messages but maybe you're heartbroken because of the fact that you want more out of the situation um and maybe it's going too slow um and maybe it's like uh, what's stopping you is because you don't want to get hurt again. You know, I feel like hurt is um, some type of fear, some type of hurt is actually keeping you from actually enjoying this person. And like I said, it could be somebody from your past and this like relationship remind you of something that from your past or maybe this could be something that this person done to you and you feel like, okay, well now we're trying to get over the hump here. Um, but I do see like when you're not with this person, you're kind of longing for the relationship. I feel like you like that it moves fast or, uh, you know, like the energy is quick, you know. I feel like there's a lot of success that's surrounding this relationship if you give it a, an opportunity and, like, don't, uh, work on not controlling it. Um, because this card right here also can represent, like, the horse and chariot, like, getting married and stuff like that. I feel like, like this is a relationship. Maybe you're longing for that, you know, a connection where you can be with somebody that you um, you get married to right you could be longing for that um but i feel like this is something that's it's gonna grow let this relationship build i feel like this person wants wants you you know i feel like i feel like it's the, they want to protect you they they're very protective of you now here's the thing though like i just feel like it's like this is a very conflicting situation because you like that protection, but then at the same time, you feel like you've had this before, right? You feel like you had this type of connection before, and maybe the person picked up and left you. So it's like you can't really, it's something about this relationship that is causing you to like not get comfortable with it. Like you like the fact that you feel like this guy can actually protect you. You may have done some protection work in this relationship, but you feel like okay why do, you know why do all this when i've been in the same exact situation and this person like and that person picked up and uh and left and i feel like you feel like this is deja vu like i just feel like you can't get comfortable in this situation for some reason the i mean like with this uh, seven of pentacles i see that you're like planting seeds right so these seeds that you actually planted is going to provide balance to you. So just hold out a little bit. Like, understand that you're going to reap the harvest of this relationship or the seeds that you planted. Like, don't let past situation uh, affect this current situation. Because I feel like this person can actually show you a lot of love. There's a lot of frustration here, you know. Um... I feel like the frustration is, is that you guys are not on the same page, to be honest with you. I feel like this person definitely can be a team player. You know, I guess you guys can definitely be a team. But there's, I think the frustration uh, with this situation is, is that you want a you want a relationship, but I feel like Libra, maybe you're, you need to do some healing before actually committing to somebody. Um, because, and this person feel like, you know, their efforts is not going, uh, or their, your, their efforts is going in vain. Like they're frustrated with the situation. They want more from you, but you, you're, you're giving them, you're giving, I feel like you're giving them a, a wishy-washy or back and forth and like type of, uh, answer. Like you, one moment you want to be in the relationship, another moment you don't, or you talk, um, you act like you don't want to be in the relationship, which is causing this person to be frustrated. You have control issues, Libra. You want to control the situation and like the universe wants you to just chill out a little bit. Um, you know, let go of those um, control issues. I mean, this is another situation like you need to like go with the flow. And then you got laughter. Like this person make you laugh. It says the laughter shared between soulmates uh, warmed the spirit in a way no uh no coat could ever so i feel like this person makes you laugh here you know you just gotta let go of these control issues and then you have some exciting news coming your way it says good news is coming your way whether it be pre a pregnancy an engagement or moving in together but get excited to celebrate it's like something that you're going to actually be able to celebrate it doesn't necessarily mean that um 
Okay. It doesn't necessarily mean that this person is like, or you guys are going to get pregnant uh, together, but it just means that there's something exciting that's happened to this relationship, but you got to let go of these control issues. Enjoy a good laugh with this person um, because this person is actually getting a little frustrated because your energy is back and forth. And I feel like their energy is back and forth. Like you probably say, well, I'm going off their energy and they're kind of being a little back and forth with me. So I, you guys need to have a conversation and work through those um those issues so anyway guys thank you for watching this video if you like the video please like the video like if you actually like it give me a thumbs up um drop me a heart at the bottom if you uh, made it this far and also um subscribe to the channel if you haven't thank you guys